Where am I? What's happening? I'm trapped in a storm. How did I get here? And where is here? Wait, there's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. I hope. Please let me make it there. So surreal. Famously called film Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. These I'm in class. Everything's cool. cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't and white? fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? She saw humanity as torture, right? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. I do love Seriously, my analog though, camera. I, could frame any one of you in a I should take a quick picture now. And capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert I haven't Pumpkins. kept up with my journal as much as I should. You can find out- If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? all about him in your textbook or even online and guys don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the everyday heroes contest i'll fly out with the winner to san francisco where you'll be feted by the art world it's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography so stella and Alyssa, get it together taylor don't hide i'm still waiting for your entry too and yes max i see you pretending not to see me Even her school books are gift-wrapped. I can't believe she made fun of me. 
Of course, Victoria has to have. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Kate looks so sad and quiet today. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. Kate, I, I hope I didn't embarrass you with my lame answer. It sucks to be dragged into the spotlight. Unless you're Victoria. She's got nothing on you, Max. Well, I should get going. Yeah, me too. Talk to you later. Sure. Obviously, Blackwell spent bank on the computer seat. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. Even though I didn't want to be in the picture at all, it was fairly fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. Huh, this might make a cool shot. <laughs> 